Welcome to the Mayor Show. As always, I always say this, we have a special guest with us today to talk about some very important things, some partnerships here, foundation in Bucks County, helping a lot of people in Bucks and here in Ben Salem. And with me today, I have Ron Bernstein. Ron is President and CEO of Foundations Community Partnership here in Bucks County. Welcome. Thank Good you. to have you here, Ron. Thank you, Mr. Good to Mayor. have you here today. We're going to talk about a lot of things that this foundation does, and uh, certainly one of the most important we'll start out with, and then I'll let Ron give you an idea of the foundation, what it does, but I know it's for special needs uh, for youth, so that's, uh, you know, it's very close to all of our hearts. And uh, Ron, give us an idea of the foundation and what it does. Okay, well, first of all, once again, thank you for the opportunity to be here. It's a great uh, situation you have and I'm thrilled to be down here talking about the foundation. Uh, first and foremost, just to make sure everybody knows, um, Foundations Community Partnership was born out of the sale of Foundations Behavioral Hospital, uh, which is in Doylestown, had been there for over 40 years, a private freestanding uh, psychiatric hospital for children and youth. In 2007, the Board of Directors sold the hospital to a for-profit company. Working with the Attorney General of Pennsylvania and the Bucks County Orphans Court, we transitioned all the funds from the sale to a philanthropic mission to support special needs children and youth strictly in Bucks County. And I'm happy to say that since 2008, we've given out over three and a half million dollars to nonprofit organizations throughout Bucks County that provide services for special needs youth and their families. So that's just uh, sort of the an framework overview. of what we a do. An overview. And uh, to let you know, this is Bucks County, but you've done several things I talked to you about here, right here in Ben Salem. Yeah. High school with uh, different things. I know foul school, and I'm going to let you talk about those things. And uh, I, I, what were the other? Oh. Uh, Liberté. Liberté. Yeah. Liberté, a uh, very important place here in Ben Salem. So talk to us about that. I mean, okay. just not Bucks, but right yep. here in Ben Salem. So. Absolutely. And, and that's one of the reasons that really I'm thrilled to be here, to make sure that everybody down here in Ben Salem knows about the opportunities to work with foundations and partner fa to, with foundations to bring some needed funds for some very special projects. So um, we get grant requests from nonprofits. We've worked a lot with uh, Liberté, which is right around oh, the yeah. corner. And we've provided them uh, three or four different grants for different projects. They're doing a new capital campaign. Right now. They're expanding their outpatient services, and we're supporting that. Um, we've also provided a scholarship uh, every year in, in Ben Salem High School and have had some outstanding students uh, get that scholarship. What do they have to do to qualify? Well, they, uh, you know, the guidance department gives them the guidelines for our scholarship. We're looking for kids who have great commitment to community service, have strong academic uh, grades, and are uh, have great quality of character, and are interested in getting involved in the helping fields. Did so we, we have one this past year. Yes, Ron? we did. We, we were at graduation. I know you were at graduation. Yeah, we try to be there all the time. So uh, we were thrilled. We have a great community here in Ben Salem, and uh, you know Bucks County couldn't have a better place to live. Absolutely. Uh, you know we're one of the best 100 places to, or 50 now, one of the best of 50 places to live. We're number 46 in the nation. Bucks County or Ben Salem? Ben Salem. All right. Ben Salem. I may have to think about relocating a little closer. Well, we like that. Now, I just saw where <laughs> Bucks County was one of the best kept secrets or something for tourism. Really? Uh, in the world. Wow. They came out of uh, number three or something, that the best kept secret. So we live in a, a region that is really is for the country. We, we're very grateful to be in this part. I, uh, I agree of, with of it, and Bucks County is a magnificent place. Yeah. But we're very proud of our Ben Salem here. Absolutely. And, and we work and hard and we cooperate with all the county, and that's what's important, what you do. Absolutely, and and I appreciate that. And I, and I think I mentioned to you last spring we were uh, privileged to get involved with uh, Ben Salem Kiwanis to support You're right. a new playground being built at uh, Faust Elementary School, school yeah. in memory of uh, the long-term guidance counselor there. 
who had passed away and her husband created, uh, uh, worked with Kiwanis and worked with us for a grant to provide that. And we're thrilled to, to do that project. That's and done. Yeah, it's that's done. Yeah. And we're always looking. So if, if you're a Ben Salem nonprofit that work with special needs youth and you have a need, uh, please, you know, go to our website, contact us. Ron Bernstein, uh, R. Bernstein at fcpartnership.org. Uh, you can apply for a grant online. And well, I'll be uh, I'll be there. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure that our places have opportunities if they're there. Yeah. That they can call you and yeah. get in touch with you because I'm sure we have a lot of nonprofits here right. doing well, a lot we, of great work. And, and like I said, since 2008, we've provided over 350 grants, totaling over. Three and a half million dollars. But I want to tell you about this other unique thing that we do, and it's called our Summer Youth Corps program, where we hire 16 Bucks County kids coming home after their freshman year of college, and we place them with nonprofit organizations in Bucks County. We pay their salaries. They spend four days a week at the nonprofit. They spend one day a week with us on a classroom structure. We have a professor from Bucks County Community College. Wow that works with the program. So the kids also get three college credits, they get a salary, and they get to learn about the, the great work that different nonprofits in Bucks County are doing. And um, every year we're always looking for 16 great kids. What a great opportunity for uh, the kids. To do wow. that. And then another thing I wanted to make sure your viewers know, know about, we're not as sophisticated as you with your TV studio, but we do have something called uh, FCP Conversations Online which are digital broadcasts with nonprofit leaders throughout, throughout the county. So we interview different executive directors from organizations like Liberté and Pro S. Buck Foundation and Family Services and the Bucks County Opportunity Council. And we put those uh, on, uh, on our website and also um, you can subscribe to it on YouTube. So we're thrilled wow. to bring our resources to bear to help the youth of Bucks County, you know. Well, I'm glad we're getting the word out. Seriously, people don't know about it. These nonprofits don't know. We give them an opportunity. Uh, maybe there's something that you can help them with. And I always say teams win, people working together. You know, you can get things done. And it seems like there's maybe some opportunities here. Absol absolutely. We've done a lot of projects in Levittown and Bristol. And, you know, not as many in Ben Salem. We'd like to be more active. Well, so now we that really I know about it, yeah, I'm going yeah. to push you guys. Okay. I'm going to be out there talking about if uh, any needs for some of these nonprofits that at least talk to you. Absolutely. Uh, you know, we, we turn down very few. Our, our goal is to make it work. And you have a board, of course. We have a board. A board uh, we have 12 uh, outside board of directors, um, many of them from the banking industry. We have representatives from Bucks County Bank, Penn Community Bank, our Merrill Lynch in, in Doylestown. We have um, a variety of uh, psychologists and social workers on the board also. So we're well represented. Uh, but we tend to, you know, some, some people think we may just be uh, focused in central bucks, but that's not true. We, we want to cover the landscape, and when uh, well, we well, you're certainly doing that today, Ron. Seriously, yeah. by coming down here into Ben Salem and letting the people know, and me, I I didn't realize. It and as I mentioned, I to you. when I mentioned to you that we had to get approval from the Attorney General of Pennsylvania, which was about a six month to a year process, they very clearly said to us, your goal is to serve all of Bucks County, and your goal is to support uh, special needs youth in our county from the top of the county to the bottom of the county and everywhere in between. So we take our marching orders from the Attorney General. They, uh, we have to write annual reports to them about our giving to make sure that we're complying with uh, their requests. And so we take it very serious and I'm thrilled to be given this opportunity to meet with you and talk with you and, and share our experience. Yeah, sure, it, it's it, very important that people know about it, especially down here. Like you say, you I didn't know about it until I met you about six months ago. Right. And we talked about it and get you on the show. Uh, I mean, there's so many, and especially special needs. I mean, there's so much that can be done and is being done. And well, you built that beautiful uh, playground. special needs yeah. playground. Yeah, not me, but uh, a whole bunch of people together, you know, with a Qantas club. Uh -huh. and, uh, 
all of our council, myself, everybody working together. We had uh, a lot of the unions give up all their time and build it for us. So that's what I always talk about, teams. You know, when you get a bunch of people in the same direction, you can accomplish a lot. Right. And that's what we do here in Ben Salem, and obviously you're doing it. So maybe we can be part of your team now. Well, maybe. we're th we're thrilled to be here and be part of your team. Well, I'm going to give you the last word and bring up anything you want. Uh, this is your sales pitch. This is your let everybody know who you are. And it, obviously on the TV screen, you'll see all the information on how to get a hold of you or, or your uh, foundation. Well, I, I guess, you know, the most important thing is if you're a, a nonprofit organization down here in Ben Salem and you're contemplating a new project or a new program or have a capital campaign, and you're looking for opportunities to find some funding, please reach out to us, Foundations Community Partnership, 267-247-5584. Our goal is to be supportive and to bring our resources to bear. So we look forward to hearing with you. Ron, thanks for great, great information. And you, the CEO, uh, President there, thanks for your job that you're doing. I know how important it is, and we're grateful. Great. So thanks for being here today. And hopefully we get some calls and we'll be talking back and forth to each other. Absolutely. You're definitely going to hear from me now that I know what you're doing. Now really I mean, okay, thank you. <laughs> Where I know. Until next time, everybody, God bless.